Again at 12:30 with the latest on breaking news, two people have been charged in the murder of a mother in Sheltonham. She was shot earlier this month while sitting in a Duncan drive-through. The district attorney is calling this crime a cold-blooded killing. Action News reporter Sharifa Jackson is live in Norristown now, where the details of the arrest were announced just a short time ago. Sharifa. <laughs> Yeah, Sarah, John, the DA, he was very emotional throughout this news conference. He says he's having a very hard time just understanding and trying to make sense of this, again, calling it cold-blooded. He says that this was a targeted shooting that was well thought out and also planned for at least two months. And he also adds that the two defendants, they neither of them knew the victim at all, neither the shooter or the mastermind, as he called it, behind this. And their names are Zaki Alakim. He's 33 years old and identified as the shooter, and 34-year-old Jolie Jean, both arrested for a number of charges, including conspiracy and murder. Now, authorities say the pair planned and conspired to murder Rachel King, who was the longtime girlfriend of a man named William Hayes. Now, Hayes had an affair with the defendant Jolie Jean last year, and after he broke it off, authorities say that Jean continued to harass Hayes and the victim, King. Now, King was killed as she waited in her car at a Sheltonham Duncan drive through as as multiple people were in line. Investigators say through surveillance and phone records, they were able to find that she was followed by the two, her son in the back seat and witness his mother's murder. The DA says he's been working again to make sense of this. The details cold blooded of this innocent woman. King's parents also spoke publicly for the first time today. I've seen a lot of horrible and even horrific um, homicides, evil homicides in my nearly 30 years of doing this um, as a prosecutor. Um, and suffice it to say, I am, uh, I'm struggling with this one, um, where a truly innocent woman is, it is targeted in a long planned murder, all because of an ended affair. We can't articulate how grateful we are for the work that has been done yes. to this point and the work that is still yet to be done, that they are committed to doing. Above all, we are in agreement. We want justice done. And King was a mother to that 11-year-old and also a well-loved teacher. Now, the DA says that Alec Heem, he is connected to another murder in Philadelphia. Again, that pair, they face multiple charges, including conspiracy and first-degree murder. We're live from the Montgomery County Courthouse, Sharifa Jackson, Channel 6, Action News. John.